on deployment voice and data communications are very very critical so the united kingdom international search and rescue teams use the hughes 9202 terminal to get out onto the internet this video clip is to show you how to connect the terminal to the internet using a laptop international backpack rdc2 we have a laptop pc8 and a Hughes 9202 big and terminal this video is to show you how to connect the two devices together and get onto the internet the first thing that we need to do is get the big and out in the open and switch it on so let's switch on the terminal Once the terminal has switched on, it is going to carry out its power on self test. It will also look for a GPS signal, but providing that the terminal has not moved a long way from its last location, that is not so critical. Now it is ready to point. Now it's easier to point with an audible buzzer so if you press this button here it will activate the buzzer and we can start pointing to where we think the satellite is and, and as you can hear by the change of tone we are we have got a decent connection anything above 40 43 is a good connection but the higher the number the better the speed of data you will get now if you press the x for about three seconds it'll try to register with the satellite once registered with the satellite we are ready to connect our laptop to the began terminal and make a data connection to get out onto the internet so we'll just just wait for it to complete its registration process with the satellite and there you are it says ready I'll just press the button again so you can see it's ready signal center 57 ready to connect our laptop we are ready to go out onto the internet but before you can do that there are two other things we need to do first is to make sure that we've got our network lead connected into the Ethernet port on the BGAN and connect the other end of the lead into the network port of the laptop. Open up a Google page, just type anything in there and you think, oh, I'm going onto the internet. All that is showing you is just what is cached in the Google internet explorer cache and there you are it says there's no internet connection so the second part we've got to what we've got to do is instigate the data connection and to do that if you just open up the began main page from the began main page there will be an option to make a connection and we are going to make a standard connection click on connect and there we are it's opening up a data connection once it's successful oh, there we are its connection was open we click OK and now we can go on to the internet Google page just type in something uh, well, that will do there you are you're out on the internet and you're surfing the web what you need to make sure that is that whenever you are not using it for any length of time so that you don't incur unnecessary charges is open up the vegan main page again and just disconnect your data connection satellite connection has been disconnected 
just click OK and you can just leave that open and just connect and disconnect as you wish.